Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be here on the Hunter Call of the Wild. We're out here on Rancho Del Arroyo and we're going to be doing the Collared Peccary Guide. So let's go ahead and jump right in. So the Peccary here on Rancho, they drink from 12am to 3am. As you can see right over here, they are class 4 animals. So that's going to give you a wide variety on the guns you could use. So guns like the 303, the M1, the Malmer 7mm, or these are the 308 will work just fine for the Peccary. But as long as it covers class 4, you are good to go. Max level is 5 medium, max weight is 31 kg, silver is 37.5, gold is 98.5, and diamond is 144.2. Common fur types are brown, dark brown, dark gray, and gray, and rare fur types are albino, leucistic, ochre, and melanistic. You can use the predator jackrabbit collar, the wild boar collar, or the wild boar scent to lure men, but that pretty much does it here for the information, so let's go ahead and jump right in. Let's go take down some collared peccary. Now the first lake that we're going to be at is over here on the left side and this one is actually really good it's just loaded down with collared peccary it only has two zones on it but you can just see how many are over here i think i counted like 31 in this zone just alone and then over here to the right we have another zone that probably has at least 30 plus in it not exactly sure if they're over here right now this was when i was finding my zones last night but anyway there's just a ton of them so we have those i see a bobcat over there which is not good whatsoever so we're gonna need to make things quick so the one we're gonna take down is that guy he is diamond potential he goes up to 159 and like we said diamond is 144 so he's got a strong chance do i think he's gonna be a diamond probably not but the chance is there so let's go ahead and take him down and should be good yeah he's gonna start dropping 50 75 25 he is already gonna be down right over there so we got him down now one thing i would recommend is getting the high tech pack if you don't like hunting at night it'll get you the night vision binoculars and the night vision scope now i'm not going to be using the night vision scope just because i don't like it it doesn't have a lot of zoom on it or anything like that um, but if you want to use it you definitely can so let's get over here and let's pick this guy up okay guys so some of these are coming back in um, that one right there as you can see is nervous from being chased off by the bobcat there's some others over here that weren't um, chased off whatsoever you can see they're calm and stuff so let's go ahead and get one of these down maybe i know there's a couple level threes and level twos and stuff like that that we can maybe get um let's see there's a level three male he goes up to 98 let's just go ahead and focus on getting him we'll use the m1 this time and yeah let's go ahead and take that shot it'll be fantastic gonna drop him on the spot we got vital blood for this guy so let's pick him up and see what he's gonna score like i said he was diamond potential but is he gonna be a diamond he will not he'll only be a gold at 129.89 so at the very bottom end of his estimates um just not close whatsoever we got him in the right scapula, the thoracic vertebrae, and the left lung. So just barely managed to get into that left lung. We just hit right behind his like neck right there, and it just squeezed right into the lungs. So thankfully, we did get a good shot. And like I said, diamond is 144, but just not close whatsoever. So let's get over here, and we'll get our level 3. And then here we have our level 3. We got vital blood on him, and we dropped him on the spot, so we knew it was going to be good. But he is a silver at 84.57, and we got him in the right lung and the left lung, so that's going to drop him every time. Um, but overall, he was pretty close to the top end of his estimates. Um, gold for them is 98.50, so he had a ways to go to be a gold, but he is a very big level 3 silver. The second spot that we're going to be at here today is still on the left side of the map, and it's going to be this crater. So it's not a very big area whatsoever. I wouldn't recommend it if you're trying to like grind for the collared peccary or something, but it's still a spot I wanted to go ahead and share with you. So we have a level 3 right here. He goes up to 100. There's a couple level 3s, I think. Um, there's another one. He goes up to 97. And then we have a level 4 that goes up to 108. So not very big whatsoever, but we are going to go ahead and take him down. So we'll get the Malmer 7mm, and we should have no problems getting him right here. So we'll go ahead and take that shot, and yeah, just going to drop him on the spot right there. Potentially could have went for another one of those, but I think we'll just focus on just getting that one. So here we have our little level 4. Let's go ahead and get him picked up. And he will be a gold at 108.70, so he's actually at the very top end of his estimates. That's kind of surprising, honestly. Got him in the left lung and the right lung, so just another fantastic shot on one of these um, collar peccaries. So let's get him accepted. Let's go to one more spot to wrap things up. Now the final lake that we're going to be at is up here in the top left hand corner of the map this is probably the best overall lake for me it has five zones on it and all of them are pretty much loaded down we have a level four right there that we're going to take down he goes up to 139 um i did spook some off from this zone and there was also a zone like right here that i had to come through this area so i ended up spooking them as well we are going to take him down we've got another zone right over there you can just see how many are over there and then right here in front of us we have another one, or maybe it's over here to the left just a bit. There they are. There's just a bunch more in here. So we have some options, but I think we will just go ahead and take down this one that's giving us a really good shot. So yeah, let's go ahead and get these R's 308, and let's get ready to take him down. 
So he is kind of quartered away right there, but I think we can get the shot. And yeah, he's going to be down on the spot, 50, 75, 25. We're not down on the spot. Um, I'm not sure exactly what happened. He just kind of stood there, but he is down. So we'll get over here and we'll wrap things up. And finally, here's our level four, getting him picked up. He's going to be a gold at 119.39. And we got him in the right lung, thoracic vertebrae, and the left scapula. So um, yeah, a little bit high on the shot. He was quartered away, like I said. But getting into the right lung of the thoracic vertebrae dropped him on the spot. So we're going to go ahead and get him accepted. Let's jump into the map guide. I will show you where you're going to have zones. Now here we have the Rancho Del Arroyo Collar Peccary map guide. Let's go ahead and take a look at it. So you may have noticed I was only hunting the top left hand side of the map. That's because that's where they're at. That's their home range. They don't drink anywhere else like on the right side or down at the bottom. They're just up there on the left side, the top left hand side. So yeah, that's pretty much going to do it here for this guide. I really do hope it was helpful. And if it was, don't forget to like and subscribe. Do all that stuff. It really does help out the channel. I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye.